The overall conviction among most analysts is that the hypothesis of how things came to be stays the major explanation for the early seasons of the universe. This speculation joins the movement of stars, planets, and thus forward life on those planets, including ourselves. Notwithstanding its odd name, the Big Bang, it offers an edifying evaluation concerning what could have happened at first. The universe was thick in a short space, more thick than a pinhead with particles thickly packed. From this second, a giant impact of matter and energy happened, known as the Big Bang. This event, happening billions of years ago, set up the spreading out of immense history. In any event, in reasonable data, it has set off developing peculiarities with the presumptions of this theory. When NASA launched the James Webb Space Telescope, the largest and most advanced space science observatory of all time, Specialists estimated that its wisdom would confirm the theory of the universe's origin. Tragically, after only one year in space, the telescope shocked specialists with its capacity to peer so deeply into the universe's past. The James Webb Telescope's stunning limits have uncovered countless universes, going as far back to a time so old that it challenges how we could decipher the universe's origins. This revelation has sparked an intense appraisal concerning what existed before the Big Bang. One critical moment in this mission happened when cosmologist Rohan Natu, working with data from the telescope, suddenly tracked down a system from just a short time after the Big Bang, making it the most far-off universe of all time seen. Natu's discovery sent shockwaves through established specialists, highlighting the remarkable skills of the James Webb Telescope. Its enormous objective to change our perspective on the universe has just barely begun promising to uncover dazzling insights into the earliest times of the universe's existence. This period, barely concentrated on beforehand, holds the key to grasping the development of the first stars and galaxies. The telescope's discoveries have conflicted with fundamental theory, uncovering systems with attributes outperforming past assumptions. This extraordinary surge of early worlds has ignited a storm of scientific inquiry, testing specialists to accommodate these discoveries with existing theories. As researchers catch up with these disclosures, they face key questions about the very nature of the universe and the forces that shaped its evolution. Beyond the James Webb Telescope's advancements, which are obvious, it is found 1.5 million kilometers away from Earth, safeguarded from cosmic interference and cooled to approach absolute zero by its tennis court-sized sun shield. The telescope integrates a large portion mirror and staggeringly delicate instruments designed to uncover details of the early universe, previously secret. This period, known as the Cosmic Dawn, happened around 200 to 300 million years after the Big Bang, marking the moment when the first stars and galaxies began to form. The process by which this unfolded remains a subject of perfect investigation with hypotheses ranging from the effects of dark matter and dark energy to the interactions between star-forming gas and dust. The telescope's view of galaxies from the cosmic dawn presents a unique opportunity for cosmologists to test how they might interpret these complex components. By studying these ancient systems, researchers can either confirm the validity of their current models or uncover gaps in understanding that could lead to major new discoveries. At first, the telescope was supposed to observe a few weak and small galaxies in its pilot studies. However, reality has far surpassed these assumptions. The telescope's early pictures of the distant universe revealed a wealth of galaxies with ages, sizes, and brightness levels that defied all expectations. This astonishing flood of early galaxies has sparked a race among space scientists to establish new standard records for the earliest known massive systems with new revelations emerging constantly, leaving conventional experts in awe. Following the James Webb Telescope's disclosures, topic specialists and observers have rushed to study the presence of these surprisingly advanced early galaxies. Some speculated that errors in the telescope's interpretation of immense observations could be responsible for these startling revelations. That said, the consensus remains that these discoveries represent a paradigm shift in how we could interpret the early universe and offer exciting glimpses into the potential for vast progress. The new revelations from the James Webb Space Telescope about galaxies have raised important questions about the nature of the universe and tested the assumptions of standard cosmological models. While some experts are examining whether these insights can be accommodated with existing theories, Others suggest that they might be the first signs that the universe is much more complex and mysterious than previously envisioned. 
The crucial question in play is our fundamental understanding of how the universe we know arose out of primordial chaos. The early discoveries of the JWST could reshape our basic ideas of cosmic history, revealing insights not only on distant galaxies and ancient structures, but also on the very nature of our own Milky Way. As Mark McFan, senior researcher for science and exploration at the European Space Agency, puts it, you build these machines not to confirm theory, but to break it. You just have no idea how it will break. The origins of the JWST can be traced back to the Space Telescope Science Institute, STSCI, in 1985, even before the Hubble Space Telescope was launched. At that time, G. Weir, then head of STSCI, was tasked with envisioning what might come after Hubble. Despite initial doubts, Weir and a small team began laying the groundwork for what would eventually become the James Webb Space Telescope. Unlike Hubble, which primarily captures visible light, the JWST was designed to observe in the infrared range, allowing it to peer much deeper into the universe. This capability is crucial for studying distant galaxies whose light has been stretched into the infrared due to the expansion of the universe, making them invisible to telescopes like Hubble. With its massive, cold, star-like mirror, the JWST became the principal instrument for uncovering the secrets of the cosmic dawn. The need for the JWST was highlighted in 1995 when the Hubble Deep Field observation revealed countless galaxies in what was once thought to be a void patch of sky. This discovery demonstrated the richness of the early universe and underscored the need for a telescope capable of probing much further into astronomical history. After 20 exhausting years of development and a cost of around $1 billion, the JWST was finally launched on December 25, 2021. By July 2022, it was ready to begin its most critical year of scientific observations. Early initiatives, such as the Early Release Science Program and the General Observing Program, were specifically designed to search for early galaxies. While initial expectations were modest, the results far exceeded them. JWST observations have tested existing models of the early universe, revealing galaxies that challenge traditional cosmological assumptions. These stunning discoveries highlight the importance of pushing the boundaries of scientific inquiry and showcase the extraordinary capabilities of cutting-edge technologies like the James Webb Space Telescope. As scientists continue to investigate JWST data, they may uncover further insights that challenge and expand our understanding of the universe. When the first data began coming in from the JWST, cosmologists eagerly awaited the results. Many had been preparing their data analysis pipelines for this moment for years. Instead of following the traditional peer review process, which usually takes months, experts chose to share their discoveries on preprint servers like AR14, a platform for research papers that have not yet been peer reviewed. This approach allowed a new form of peer review to take place through online platforms like Twitter, where established specialists could quickly discuss findings. Rohan Natu described this process as science by press release, and the ensuing storm of discussion was both intense and remarkable. However, there were concerns about the potential drawbacks of this rapid dissemination of results. Claus Pontypool, a JWST project researcher at STSCI, cautioned that while the fast sharing of results facilitated quick dissemination and discussion, there was also the risk of overwhelming the process. The general understanding among most specialists is that the theory of how things came to be remains the primary explanation for the early seasons of the universe. This speculation joins the development of stars, planets, and life on those planets, including ourselves. Notwithstanding its odd name, the Big Bang offers a convincing explanation for what could have occurred at the universe's beginnings. The universe was densely packed into a space smaller than a pinhead, filled with densely packed particles. From this moment, a huge burst of matter and energy occurred, known as the Big Bang. This event, happening billions of years ago, set the unfolding of cosmic history. However, changes in scientific data have led to developing abnormalities with the assumptions of this theory. When NASA launched the James Webb Space Telescope, the largest and most advanced space science observatory ever built, analysts estimated that its observations would support the theory of the universe's origin. Tragically, after only one year in space, the telescope astonished specialists with its ability to peer deeply into the universe's past. The James Webb Space Telescope's amazing abilities have uncovered galaxies 
dating back to such ancient times that they challenge our understanding of the universe's origins. This discovery has sparked a serious examination of what might have existed before the Big Bang.